Hi, my name is Jovi, and welcome back to Kids Corner. Um, today, before we start our actual lesson, we're gonna do a little fun game called Who Am I? And here's how it goes. This here's how you play. So you have to guess these Bible characters from two different pictures. So before we start, I want to say no going to the answers because I'm going to say the answers and don't go to the answers and then come back and guess the answers. All right, so don't go to your Bible and peek, right? Yeah. All right, I'm going to zoom in a little bit so the pictures are clear. Okay? okay. All right. So the first one are these two pictures. It's a little man and a blank tree. Have you guessed it? If you did, it would be Zacchaeus in the sycamore tree. Zacchaeus was a wee little man, and the wee little man was he. He climbed up in the sycamore tree for the Lord he wanted to see. Yep, that's a song. Okay, and then the next one, switch this aside, is number three. That might be backwards. The number three and a blank man. If you guessed it right, it's the three wise men. Next one is a boat, a huge boat and blank. If you've guessed it right, it's Noah and the Ark. Because this is Noah and then the big boat, which is called an ark. The next one is a lion and a man outside here. He's praying. He's praying to God. But we can't say his name. Mm -mm. There like that. That's good. Okay, if you've guessed it right, it's Daniel and the lions. Remember, he got into the cage with the lions. He got thrown into the cave. The cave, not the cage. Okay, so next is a little shepherd man with some sheep. And then a slingshot. And I'm not going to tell you what they shot with the slingshot. This one is David and Goliath. Whenever David got the big, huge, giant Goliath. Yeah, but do you, I'm gonna ask you a quick little question, a quick little question to answer. Do you really think that all of these people in the Bible really dreamed for this to happen? Do you think they went, hmm, I wish that I could fight um, a giant. Or if someone said, I wish I could get thrown into a ca cave with me by mean man men and have a bunch of lions. I don't think that was their dream, do you? No. Or you could... Or you don't want to wish to get on a big, huge ark with so much animals and have a flood, right? Right. Or have people make fun of you because you're building that big boat. Mm-hmm. Oh, shoot. I forgot what this story is about. The three wise men? Yeah. Taking the gifts to Jesus? Oh, yes. Do you I think they dreamed of riding a camel for days and days? And yeah. And you think they dreamed of meeting the Messiah? Yeah. Probably not. Well... That's a good dream, though, right? Yeah, it's it's very surprising at first, but then right. you're like, ooh, this is fun. But you probably didn't wish. They probably didn't like, think of that. They probably didn't wish to see the Messiah because you're going to, because he's coming back in. Yeah, right, but they didn't know that back then. Yeah, true. 
and would you wish to see to be a man who is in a sycamore tree seeing everyone and see the messiah telling you to come down yeah that would be good but i bet everybody was making fun of him because he was so small i know right okay so yeah let me turn to the page so Good. Well, let's talk about our dreams and sometimes yeah. what we dream of and then sometimes what happens. Okay. When you were growing up, you all had dreams, right? Yeah. But others might have asked, what do you want to be when you grow up? They would ask you. You want to dream it, they would ask you. Maybe your dream was a nurse, doctor, teacher, engineer, truck driver, pharmacy worker, anything you want. Or maybe you dreamed of having work, a family, and a happy future. None of us dreamed of becoming drug addicts or alcoholics or having a divorce or terminally ill, like having cancer. And there's so much things that you wish that you didn't dream about. But those things can happen sometimes. They can just pop right out at you and you don't even know it. Keep in mind that whatever dream you have, Christ should remain in the center of it. Even if the dream is a nightmare for the moment, he'll be there to pull you through the trial. It's really pretty because I, I read this and um, I kind of made it up in my own words for, um, whenever it said terminally ill. Um, to me that can be cancer, the flu, anything, but cancer, getting a divorce, um, becoming a dicks, they can just pop out right out. All right, we don't plan that, do we? Can we never like, think it's going to happen to us, and those things can ruin your dreams, can't It can can't be like they? a really mean person walking by, and you walk right into them. Right. That's right. So. Let's okay. find that little scripture with Psalm 31. I saved it. Good thing I saved it. Is it right there? No. No. Nope. That's our old. Psalm 31. Those tabs help. Okay, there we go. Psalm 31, 14, and 15. Nice and loud. Okay. But I trust in you, O Lord. I say you are my God. My time's in your hand. Rescue me from the hand of my enemies and from my persecutors. Right. And I like that part. My time is in your hand. Mm -hmm. Right? He's responsible for that. Yeah. All right. Well, let's have a little prayer. Oh, say, you should be responsible for that. Yeah, should, God doesn't tell us. Yeah. We might be responsible for some of the bad things that happen to us, but God's going to help us get through them. Mm -hmm. right? And also, one thing, this isn't a lesson, but never get mad at God. That's right. Because he didn't do nothing to He you. didn't do it. We did it. Yeah. All right, let's end in a little prayer, and let's, let's pray that everybody's really good dreams come true if it's the dream God wants them to have. <laughs> right? Mm -hmm. Okay. You want to pray or you want me to? How about you pray too? Okay, I will. All right. Dear God, thank you, Lord, for dreams. Sometimes we have dreams that maybe aren't what you want us to have, but you allow us to make mistakes to show us that you're there to help us through that. So, Lord, let us, let us focus on what you would want us to do and to keep you in the center. And when we feel lost, let us pray to you to help us get back on track. Watch over people that are living little nightmares now, like people who are addicts, people who have serious diseases, and just let them know you're with them. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 Very pretty. Bye. Bye.